Hi, my name is Kirk Phipps with Hayes Fluid Controls. In this video, we will review the steps needed to replace the internal balancing components of the Hayes 2514 automatic balancing valve. The sample we will use today is the Hayes model 2514 automatic balancing valve. The balancing components are what we consider our measure flow design. These consist of two components, the diaphragm and the orifice plate. These pieces work in conjunction to limit the total flow to a desired amount, often the maximum GPM allowed through a coil. They can be found inside this portion of the valve body. You will need to use a wrench to loosen the cap and remove it entirely by twisting it off with your fingers. You can remove the diaphragm and pull out the orifice plate. Based on the newly desired flow rate, the replacement balancing components will have been sent to you and will resemble this bag. This includes a new orifice plate, diaphragm, o-ring, flow rate sticker, and instructions. Insert the new internals into the valve. The orifice plate legs facing out and with the diaphragm lying flat against the ridges of the orifice plate. Either side is correct. Reattach the cap and tighten with a wrench to complete the process.